Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. All right, you might recognize the background. I just got finished filming my top five glitter bells acrylic colors for spring slash summer. So that was really exciting. It was actually really exciting to pick up those five colors. And I kind of went into it thinking, okay, I need to pick up these colors. Like I need to figure out which ones are my top five. And then the more I like, pulled and the more I like looked around through them and kind of dug through my acrylic colors the more I was like oh wait a minute this is kind of fun I have a client this morning 6 45 so we're all done picked out those filmed that those favorites videos are super 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 short and I really want to keep them that way because I feel like when they're super short like that they're just easier for you guys to consume like I don't know about you but for me when I see somebody's vlog that's like too windy minutes let's say I in my head don't watch it right away I have a time when I know I want to watch it whether it's like on the treadmill or between clients or just on a Sunday afternoon like I'll save it but when I can find those like quick to devour little videos of favorites and stuff like that swatches um I think that's I really like those so I tend to just devour those and those are the ones that you do like one after the other after the other right so anyway I moved this plant to have it for the background but what she needs some TLC meaning I need to take some of these babies and do something with them I didn't count them there's just so many and they're all intertwined and some of them are like big and probably ready to do whatever you do with them I you know like people are like oh my god I don't know how with those plants yeah me neither dude me neither uh, they get morning sun. I give them town water. Right now our town water is so friggin dirty that you have to clean the toilet every day. So no, I don't know how. I don't know how. Maybe they're getting extra minerals from the town water. I don't know. I brought my computer with me today. I am going to pop the footage from that last video right into the computer because the sooner I get it in there, the sooner I'll get it edited and out to you guys. I really would like to have that out tonight. Everything's really dusty this morning. I mean, not that I don't make dust for a living, but I just feel like all I do is dust. I'm sure you guys feel that way too. Later, let's get this done. because um, past me thought it would be a good idea just to walk out on um, Friday night and not clean anything. Here we are. But I wanted to, where are you going? Where are you going? I'm trying to get the lighting because, and I'm not complaining, it is so bright outside that the lighting is not good. Anyway, okay. One thing I wanted to run through really quick before I kind of started this salon vlog. You wanna see everything I do, here we go. So I am also a vendor next door in the store. So there is a little vintage boutique next door and I bring in just a few things over there. So I, one thing I do bring in that goes super well, I love them so much, is little farm beads. They're so cute. So I have a reorder of those, a little bit of a restock. How sweet are these? So they are Chakra Crystal Collection. So it's a line and balanced stones, tourmaline, carmeline, citrine, rose quartz, kyanite, amethyst, uh, coconut wood bowl, and crystal information cards. So you get your crystal information cards to tell you about the crystals because we all need that. I mean, they're so difficult to get to know. Then we have a little coconut bowl and everything's in it. It's just the sweetest. I love it so much. So there's a couple of different ones of those. And then 
There's a couple of different ones of these. These are sage crystal kits. So it has a quartz tower, abalone shell. The abalone shells are so beautiful. Island of the Blue Dolphins, am I right? Um, amethyst. Oh, a Palo Santo. Blah, blah, blah. Gorgeous. Like, how pretty is that for a gift? I was so happy with this stuff. There's a couple of little sprigs of lavender in there. And then I got regular uh, sage, like regular sage bundles, which I can't show you because they're all bundled up together until I get them priced. I also got rose quartz. Oh my god, I love them so much. And there's selenite of the same thing. So like a little selenite stick. So sweet. And they're not terribly heavy. They're quite light. So that's really neat. And then I have liquid chrome homemade, beautiful green glass, um, lavender cuticle oil. So I'm gonna be putting that on the shelf. They're not official just yet. This is this is the testing of them. Um, I'm gonna use one of course on my own desk and then I'm gonna let some of my diehard clients try them and see if they like them. I really like the mixture. I really like the ingredients. So I can't, I can smell them a little bit. So I thought I'd try them. It's a pretty good size, happy with that. So I'm gonna put these out for retail, get my coffee poured, get my lunch in the fridge, get my mess cleaned up because apparently I brought in a bunch of stuff on my shoes and Wow, that is warm coming in there. Ooh, my limes grew over the weekend. I'll show you in a minute. So what I also haven't shown you is, hold on. I got the coolest wax melter from Kelsey's Claws. I will link her down below. She also, um, like you can find her on Instagram, so it's Kelsey's Claws. And she has a creations page and she has wax melt. This one is cherry, and this so far is my favorite. So I've only burned geisha, and a blue one that I can't remember, <laughs> and cherry. I love cherry so much. So I have a little tea light here, and I'm gonna pop it in here and light it. Um, I do have a plug-in warmer that I'm gonna use after a while, but I had a whole bunch of tea lights at home. So I thought, I'm gonna get a warmer and go through those tea lights. And um, plus it's cute to have a little candle burning anyway. I love them. And it does help to dissipate the acrylic smell. In case anybody's wondering. Um, I know in the forums, that's a big question a lot of times, like dissipating the acrylic smell. So that's what I've got for you. Losing time, I'm fading fast I just wanna make it last Try to let go of the past I close my eyes, embrace the blast Sleepless nights and headaches stack Restlessness to hell and back What's my purpose, what do I grab? A slippery surface, a heart attack And sometimes you just gotta believe There's something that'll give you relief There's something that'll have what you need what you need. We're broken, it's tragic, we're not all elastic, but maybe there's magic, believe you could have it, and I know of sadness, the anxious in panic, the infinite vastness of all that is blackness. wondering what you guys use to wipe your acrylic brush on. Um, not so much your gel brush, but your acrylic brush. Because I use, um, I don't have any left, so let me just Google this. I could have been ready. I use, images guys, images. These, the expert touch um, table towels, and I cut them. 
Before that, I used blue shop towels because I felt like they were the only towel that was like really lint free. But I ran out of the OPI towels, or I'll be out by the end of today. And I reordered them, so they're on their way. They're the only thing I get from Maritime Beauty, which is the closest to me, which kind of sucks because I just have to pay the shipping on them. Oh, and they only had one. I one one i was going to buy like five packages of them obviously like let's just get them here and they only have one like i put in five and then it kept uh correcting it back down so i four three two i can only order one so i've got those ordered but anyway long and short of it is what are you guys ordering because or what are you guys using i mean i love what i'm using but i'm also willing to switch it up and maybe i won't be able to get those again I tried Amazon. I didn't see anything unless I might have to dig deeper, look again. There might be uh, another version of them somewhere. I'd have to look around and see who else carries OPI, like whether Canada Nail Supply says or somewhere like that. But again, it's just not one of those places that I order from. Frequently, I prefer to order from AR Nail Supply. Uh, so anyway, <laughs> let me know what you guys are using. I'm just cleaning up between clients. I have one more client left for the day. I started early this morning, um, which I do quite often start very early. Hold on, let me get these out of here. I have cracks in my fingers and taking the drill bits out of here is sometimes like, anyway. First world problems. Rinse those. Try not to like put my back to you constantly. Clean up, I have one more appointment, and then, and then I don't know, and then we're oh, moving around, waddling. And then I'm going to go home and make my supper. I have one of those Hello Fresh Good Food, no, it's good food, boxes to make. I made one last night. <laughs> anyway, I'm feeling so jittery today. Also, I bought a new cleaner. Like not, like I still have this cleaner, my preamp, but I bought this to have here. It is all-purpose cleaner. It's 99% whatever. It's the Attitude brand. And it is thyme and citrus, and I really love it. Um, I just find like, in between clients and stuff, like I have my disinfectant that I use, but I'm finding that for like all other things because those gallons of disinfectant are really expensive. So it's not like I just want to be go wiping everywhere with it. Uh, so I did get some of that. So hopefully this vlog hasn't been too boring. I know it upsets people when I'm boring. But you know, the joys of that is that you can always unsubscribe. hasn't been too boring this has been a long video to film like I have been filming this vlog for two weeks so I actually can't remember um, what is entirely in the rest of it so hopefully for real it's not too boring hopefully okay I'll see you guys next time thanks for being here thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed yet please do so if you wanna like this video, I'm not begging you to do it, okay? But it does help the algorithm. And I will see you guys next time.